The Fire Talent Ostrich is 3,500 credits on Archage Legacy or 350 Mana Storm Crystals on Archage Unchained. A long time ago, this mount was also given away for free as part of a giveaway. In the marketplace where it's marked bonus on the top of the icon for the mount, that means that when you buy the mount, you'll get the armor to go along with the mount as part of a package. It is also an indicator that only armor specific to that mount can be equipped. Any dungeon armor for mounts that drop out of Hadir Farm, for example, cannot be equipped on these specialized mounts. One of the abilities on the mount's attack bar are slightly different than the description. The ability named Overwhelm in the description is named Kick on the attack bar. I don't know why that is, it's just a quirk of this mount. The mount's two attack abilities are Kick and Peck Peck. You can't use the mount like a battle pet. In order to use the mount's fighting abilities, you have to stay seated on the mount. However, you can use Songcraft buffs while fighting and have a battle pet out. It could make for some interesting farming. Archage is filled with quirky things like this. And just to explain quickly, the difference between the Power Stone pet and the Battle pet is that the Power Stone pet is just there to give you buffs, whereas the Battle pet actually fights. But keep in mind, when you do this type of farming, the Battle pet does not automatically attack your target. There are a couple of things that you can do here. You could use a different mount with an arrow attack, and then the pet will attack whatever you attack, or else you have to get off the mount and hit the mob first, which kind of defeats the purpose. I don't know why that is, because you're on a mount attacking the mob with the mount's abilities. It doesn't make a whole lot of sense that some mount's abilities will trigger the battle pet to attack, while others won't. Another way to get the battle pet to attack while you're on a mount is to choose a mob that has an area effect spell. Once the pet is attacked, it will aggro onto the mob. If not, the pet will just sit there looking stupid. While this mount goes fast on land, it does slow down greatly in water to 2.2 to 2.6 meters a second. The mount speed starts off at 11.5 meters per second. With its full set of armor, speed increased gems, and songcraft buffs, it can go even faster. The gems for the pet armor are the same gems that you buy with honor points for your own gear. Keep in mind, there's only three types of gems that can go into pet and mount armor. Speed increased gems for the feet, physical defense, and magic defense for the head and chest. Other gems will not work, like resilience gems, for example. Even though that specific gem says it's for the chest and feet, you will not be able to put it into pet or mount armor. The two strong points of this mount is that it can run fast and it has an ability to jump farther than normal mounts. Because of the jump ability, you can go up certain mountain paths that would normally be too steep to walk up or too steep for other mounts to run up. You'll just have to figure out which ones you're able to do through trial and error, but it is possible to get up some of them.